Hi, John X here. Welcome to part four of my Jazz Fill lesson series. In this part, I'm going to teach you a classic jazz fill that's played using three eighth notes with the hands and one with your foot. We'll start out by playing the first pattern between the snare and the high tom. Now, instead of playing the pattern using a right-left-right sticking, we'll play it only using the right hand. Here's example number one played as a two bar fill from two bars of a swing time feel. To make a smooth transition from your time feel into the fill, be sure to stop your jazz ride pattern with a quarter note on the fourth beat of the measure just before the fill. Also, you may notice that I'm ending the fill using a cymbal and snare hit. This is a handy way to come out of any fill that ends with the bass drum. Now we're going to apply a stick on stick technique to the snare drum parts. The next three examples are based on a three beat swung eighth note pattern and are written in a three four time signature. Now we'll create a fill that crosses the bar line. We're playing in 4-4, but the phrasing of the fill implies a 3-4 time signature. Here's a nice idea I picked up from Philly Joe Jones. On the third beat of the measure, play the quarter notes with your right hand using a single stroke on the low tom and with your left hand using a buzz stroke on the snare drum.
try this two bar fill using the Philly Joe technique. Well, that wraps up part four in my Jazz Fill lesson series. Thanks for watching and I sure hope you enjoyed it. If you'd like to purchase a transcription of this lesson or any of my video drum lessons, go to my website at www.johnxdrums.com, go to the video lesson link and simply select the transcriptions you would like to purchase. Before I go, I would like to thank my good friends at Vic Firth, Zildjian, Aquarian, and Drum Workshop for their amazing products and generous support. We'll see you again soon. Bye now.